What's going on guys? 2005 uh, Mazda MPV was called out here because the car was overheating. Uh, we checked the operation of the fan and we didn't see uh, no operation at all. The fan was not working. So uh, we diagnosed it and found out it was the module. The module was faulty. So we just got a, uh, a new module and the uh, fan is working. But it is not working according to the needs of the car. And uh, because of that, the car is still overheating. And I'm trying to figure out, is it a faulty module that we got? A new module, faulty new module, or could the, uh, the radiator relay itself Radiator fan relay itself uh, could be uh, could be faulty, so that's where I'm at. Uh, over here, I got the uh, engine coolant temperature pulled up here. Um, 220. Is, uh, it seems to be uh, you know the needle is is very much on the low side. Definitely not even in the middle yet, and we're reading uh, 222. So I guess this engine will run hot naturally, and um, uh, the fan. Duty cycle is at 77 percent and uh, yeah so so far this is good operation but the only problem is the fan will just stop working all of a sudden it'll just drop out while the command here will stay at uh, for example let's say 80 percent but the fan will drop out and it will sh still show you 80 percent right here at the command so not sure how to not sure how to how to diagnose this what I was thinking of doing is uh, unplug powers and ground main powers and ground coming to the module and maybe uh, uh, substitute a load but then I will have to run the car long enough uh, and hopefully it will not overheat the car because the fan will not come on and I will see how long it takes uh, until the light goes out if it will go out and if it goes out then I have no doubt that it's a it's a uh, uh, it's a relay issue maybe or a PCM issue you know uh, and if it doesn't drop out at all to the entire time I might be leaning towards a uh, faulty uh, new module uh, other thing that I will note here the module gets really 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 hot absolutely it's like scorching hot I'm uh, not sure now if they have a safety mechanism. Uh, exactly, right now, just watch it. No more noise. The fan is off. We see 80% duty cycle, but the fan is off. Now it's coming back on. You can hear it. Look at the duty cycle right there, 80%. The fan about to drop out soon again. When it starts dropping, it's, it's keep dropping. second there I put my hand right there on the module right now oh yeah it's warm it used to be hotter than this but it's definitely warm they got a heat sink in the back there okay let's see how long it just dropped up no more noise let's look at the duty cycle 84 percent which is full full duty right there and it dropped out now it's going back up and I'm not on the uh, the AC is not on actually the AC is not on so AC is definitely not on and the temperature is still climbing so it's not like the temperature is dropping to where the fan will shut off no but it's just dropping out it's just like losing power going all the way down to zero at the fan level not at the uh, the command level actually I'm going to get my uh, flashlight so I can show the fan so you know it's not just slowing down it's completely stopping so yep let's, let's look at the fan there it stops completely goes back stops completely nothing stops completely goes back so like I said, is it a bad module? Which is a, it's a brand new module. We just ordered it from Rock Auto. The temperature is still climbing, and the duty cycle is at 88, 90 percent, and this thing is just not responding to that. So this, I believe, will be the fuel. I mean, the relay for it. We got the two fuses right here for the fan. 
pipe and this would be the the, the, the relay for it then uh, here we go I mean if anybody had this issue before uh, you know any uh, suggestion help would be definitely appreciated because um, I'm I don't have a scope I'm not sure you know if I had a scope I probably could back probe the uh, command wire and, and, and see what's going on um, maybe I'll see that the PCM itself is is uh, not commanding it on or something that would be something definitely that I would want to watch for but since I don't have a scope uh, to test that uh, signal wire from the PCM uh, this is about it right now for me so if anybody has any clue on what direction to take next would be great to appreciate it and uh, yeah so I'm signing off here uh, at this point I'm thinking of as this doesn't cost a lot of money uh, throwing parts at it basically just try to replace that before I return that module uh, that'll be the next step and if we replace that and we still have the same symptoms my guess would be to return the module and take it from there and try to get another one and see what happens and if the other module comes and does the same thing then I don't know uh, we gotta look at the PCM I guess right <laughs> chasing something ghosts or something but yeah now it's doing it constantly and this is the reason why it's going to overheat look at the temperatures keep climbing because the fan would not stay on that's it it just started malfunctioning let me see if I can crush this module. It's burning hot. This module is freaking scorching hot right now. I mean, yes, I got my hand on it, but I can, it's really hot. So, that's what it is, guys. If you came across it, if you diagnosed it properly before, you had a similar issue, please comment. Signing off.